A hot-headed minor league basketball coach finds himself leading a team of unlikely all-stars in the heartwarming comedy Champions, starring Woody Harrelson. Hi, I'm Bobby Farrelly. Here's a scene from Champions. Remember Marcus Markovich? You gotta make that! Well, he got fired. Marcus, get off the court. Oh! That wasn't nice. Nothing but bad news for the Iowa Stallions. What an idiot. If you don't like laughing and if you don't like having a great time and being happy, you might want to leave right now. <laughs> but if you do like having a good time and laughing, and you're going to have a great time. We had so much fun making this movie. It is a true underdog story. It's a fun story. He's a little bit flawed. He's got some growing to do. And over the course of the movie, he hopefully does do that. I will offer you community service. Coaching adults with intellectual disabilities. Your Honor, we're talking re re Whoa. No boo-boo words. Well, Marcus does get in a little trouble with the law and goes before the judge, and she tells him, OK, well, you got a choice. You can either go to jail, or you can go and coach these people with disabilities, which he thinks for a minute, like, do I want to? OK. It's impossible to coach these guys. You don't have to turn them into the Lakers. They just need to feel like a team. Uh. He's met other Marcuses before, you know, because he, they they come through the uh, to the center and then they need to be uh, instructed in some way. You're getting a player off the injured list. Casentino! Casentino! Woody was definitely the right actor to play Marcus. Uh, I always say is that he's so likable. You know, he really is. Even when he's making a mistake, even when you know he's wrong, and you're watching him do something stupid, there's something about him where you still. You go with him. So there's a sympatheticness to his character. This is my sister, Alex. You want to do a cup of karaoke with us? I don't like karaoke. I get knocked down. Can I, I get, get up, up again? again? You're never going to keep me down. Alex doesn't have a great experience with him in the beginning of the movie. Well, uh, the very beginning, at night. <laughs> yeah, we don't know. It we, may have been great. We, we, we suspect it, that was really, great. I don't they, know. It starts in the morning anyway, doesn't it? Like I said, not a great experience. <laughs> and then when she finds out that he's coaching her uh, brother's basketball team, I think she's very uncomfortable and sees in this character that he just wants to win, and she really sees the value of looking at each individual person and expecting their own personal best and seeing that as a win. I'm new to all this. Yeah, you can tell. Hey, we got next. Don't make me say it. Make you say what? They're <laughs> That's a boo-boo word. We got next. Well, finding them was the was the tough part because we I didn't know where to look, and so we we look we had an open casting call all over the U.S. and Canada. These ten that we cast, they just all stood out for different reasons. Each one was a little bit different, but together it ca came together as a nice ensemble, and they're all excellent actors. Not only could they play basketball and act which they had never done before. One spoke seven languages, one was a great musician, you know. It was interesting to see all those aspects of their personality and, and their abilities come out. Bro, Hermione, bro! Yeah, yeah! We worked with some incredible actors. Some of them are first time actors. We're just so incredibly proud of this movie. It makes you feel good, it makes you laugh. They're all awesome. They, they love the game, it's authentic. And they really did. It wasn't acting. They really enjoyed being out there playing. We've been following your incredible story, Coach. Marcus is just one win away from qualifying for the regional tournament. I don't know if you're brave or crazy. Give me a hug, Coach! But I know this is your shot at being champions. <laughs> These friends really start to, you know, kind of cultivate the the inner, more vulnerable side to his nature. Of course, my relationship with Caitlin, with Alex, her, her character, really also helps to make Marcus a, a better man. And so his learning to love is what shifts him completely. Thanks for checking out this video. We want to know what would you have asked? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button. And as always, for more videos like this, hit the MIH TV logo right here. And for the next awesome video, click right there.